How old are you? 27. Where did you go to school? Harvard. Um, Harvard Business School. Your address? American Gardens Building, West 81st Street. Mm, nice. Very nice. Thanks. My name is Patrick B. I'm 27 years old. There is an idea of a Patrick B. But there is no real me. Only an entity. So... Hey everyone, what's up? As you've seen in the preview, in this video, I'm about to show you how exactly you can create the perfect AE-like smooth zoom-in edit using only CapCut and Trust Me. After watching this tutorial, you won't need to check out any other zoom-in tutorial ever again. But before we jump straight into the tutorial, if you're new here, what are you waiting for? Join our community by hitting that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. Let's straight to the video. So first, introduce your all clips and make sure all clips should be 60 FPS or even more. If you don't know how to turn 60 FPS clips into 120 FPS, then let me know in comment. Now add beats in the music. Now we're going to resize the clips according to the ratio. Follow my steps. Do same process with all clips. Now after this, adjust the clip's duration according to the beats. Follow me. Again, do same process with all clips. Now let's review it. As you've seen, it is smooth now. Now main work is going to be here. Follow my steps and you will get the result.
again, do same process with all clips. Now after zoom in, it looks like this. To make it more smooth and engaging, we will use graph. Use this graph setting for smoothness. It's done, let's review it. You see how smooth it became. Now we're gonna add an overlay to make a transition of first clip. It's perfectly done now. Although it's done, but you can add motion blur for extra smoothness to your edits. For this, import the video again and come to motion blur option and apply this adjustment. Now if you watch this full video, please hit the like button and let me know what tutorial you want next. I will see you in the next video.